YouTube, Dan Life of Yad Ramel, lots of on my channel. Today is September 22nd, and there's another video for my viewers. Cars are going by. I just took a, like a five minute break. Doesn't look like I really, anything's changed, and I'm still, you know, talking pretty good. But I'm going to continue off from what I was talking about before. After you went to food bank, hang out with a cousin a little bit, and then I had some other stuff to do because I wanted to get home and do my video logs for my viewers because that's probably going to be up about seven or eight tonight because. After all these are recorded, I have to upload the, you know, uh, uh, sorry, sorry, I have to transfer them to my laptop and then upload it to YouTube and wait, 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 and then do the, uh, the animation intro and the mu uh, music singing outro and you'll know, splice off a little bit of, you know, like a minute or two off the front and a minute off the other uh, at back or Maybe I just splice off something else and make sure I get into the 15 minute mark. And right now I'm going to see if my uh, camera is actually working. Because I don't want to be sitting here all this time. Can I actually see the other corner? No, I really is too bright. <clears throat> so today was not a really bad day at all. And not really much left to talk about. I might as well talk about, you know, the other day. Recap yesterday, yes. Uh, after doing these videos, uh, uploading to my uh, laptop, or downloading my laptop, and then uploading to YouTube. I mean, that's usually the process. I went down the street, you know, hang on the deck, and then, you know, started asking questions, like, okay, I know that person's name, I know her boyfriend's name, I know she's got cats, and then not really anything else more to say. I don't really know anything about her. And I want to just ask a bunch of questions, like being snooty, not snooty, being, uh, being snoopy, I guess you could say, snoopy. But, you know, I don't really have to even ask much questions because a lot of stuff, you know, gets talked about on that deck about anybody and everybody and what's going on in life. In the beginning, you know, it was kind of annoying. And you know, they know that, you know, if I'm talking about a family member or a friend. They don't need to know, get back to them if you know it's good or bad. And then there's you no know, family or member or friend that was on the deck, you know, talking about me. And it gets back to me, and then it's like, don't really like that. I mean, sometimes a little bit like talking. I mean, there's got to be something, someone, someone talking about this person, that person. But usually, you know, they learn to try to, you know, stay out of some people's business sometimes, but not as much as the best friend. You know, he's always in people's businesses and want to be part of things and know what's going on and I don't know he's like he's like the street sheriff or something like that and he doesn't really watch my videos he's he's one of the uh, haters you know he doesn't watch any of my videos I'm surprised this one lady and maybe her sons are watching my videos I mean my videos aren't spectacular there's nothing about superheroes or action figures or how to this or uh, the latest greatest this or that and I don't know I'm, Maybe I'm a little entertaining to them. I don't know if they watch a lot of videos or they watch some every now and then. Or if she watches a lot of them. I don't know. Maybe it's a good bedtime story to them. And, you know, I told her, you know, I think like four days ago, I told her, I think. <coughs> no, two days ago, but two days ago, I told her, I said, you know, check out my video. It's blah, blah, blah. And I said, you're in it, you know, and talking to your, your sons about it and stuff. And then. Maybe she actually did check it out and it's like, it was talking about, you know, a lot of my content, I don't have any swearing. Maybe there might be a slip or, you know, something that shouldn't be said, but most of my stuff, is, you know, newborn babies can watch. There's like really nothing going on. What? Just wake up. You know, newborn babies, like three months to, I don't know, 90 years old, probably watch videos like mine and, or, you know, Maybe one day they'll watch videos like mine. And I got, you know, normal content every day. Well, pretty average anyway. It's pretty average for, like, before, you know, uh, YouTube was booming. But like I said, I don't swear. I'm not violent. I talk about things. There's nothing bloody. There's not how-to and food review and um, skits and pranks and stuff like that. There's none of that stuff. It's just a pretty normal... It's just a pretty normal uh, vlog every day. And if her sons want to you know, 
watch it around um, bedtime and you know it's like me doing it tell them a story uh, I don't know if they're really into stories and I think one seven or eight did I was about ten and I don't know if they really get their mom to do bedtime stories or is their father do pet bedtime stories or they watch you even or even if they uh, read bedtime stories themselves or anything like that it's mostly just laptop uh, tablet or whatever or you know on this little set her cell phone a little bit, a little bit of gaming if they're not fighting over it and whatever I guess whatever they do in their life I've not really chilled here. You know what? That's one place I haven't really chilled. Like, chill, legit chilled for a day. Or half a day, a quarter of a day. I've never really chilled there. I mean, they're usually on the yard or on deck or, you know, gone to school or um, gone for a, a ride, you know, someplace. And I don't know. I don't really know what goes on there. Maybe one day I might have dinner there. I don't know necessarily if I make dinner and bring it to her or. If she would, you know, make dinner, she wouldn't have to really do that because she's got kids. Um, maybe chill with them, you know, maybe sleep on the couch one day, at least one day to say, hey, you know, I've been there, I slept there. But she probably snores, they probably snores, even their, their, her cats probably snore. And she's got a little bit of a, a short temperature. And she's got a little bit of a short temper sometimes. Short temper. Very short. No, she's not really that short. That's something that I pick on her because you know she's smaller. I mean, if I'm not if I'm not bugging her, you know, she might probably think something's wrong with me or anybody else that doesn't bug her. Because you no, know, that's a way of life. We're we if we evolved from monkeys, a lot of monkeys bug their monkeys and they're you know, poking at them and bugging them about their fur and you know tapping them in the head and running around and laughing and stuff. I mean, that's what monkeys do. Monkeys bug other monkeys. And that's the way they are, just monkeying around sometimes. Um, I got my cat on my lap now. My cat. Yeah, my cat, my cat. My cat, my cat. Yeah, my cat. I was just looking at time pet my cat. 3.36 right now, exactly, because it just flipped. 3.36. So there might be a kids coming off the bus out there sometime. Not exactly sure if and when. So does that mean I got one more video to do? I don't know. When I'm shaving off like a couple minutes each time and letting the camera cool and stuff, you know. I don't know. I kind of lost my train of thought because my cat here, my cat, yeah, kind of threw me off a little bit. So I don't know. Like I was saying, you know, most of my content's pretty, pretty average. You know, pretty average content. Nothing really, anything spectacular. You know, there's going to be younger kids. There's going to be probably lots of kids of all, all of different ages and races and, uh, you know, male, female, whatever. Watching videos like mine. That's fine. If you guys like my daily vlogs and use it at night as a storytelling, you know, thing, you get your kids to bed, sure, that's no problem with me. I don't have no problem with that. You can share this video on your channel, too, and, you know, share with your friends and family and uh, subscribers and viewers or whatnot, you know, doesn't really bother me. I'm not a stickler with a lot of people. It's like, oh, you can't use my uh, video on your, your thing, you know. What are you doing? It's like, oh, I'm going to I'm gonna tell YouTube on you so you'd be copyrighted. No, I'm not. I'm not that mean. I mean, some people need to just let things go and move on with it. And besides that, being copyrighted. I know I should let things go, but, you know, copyright it. There's, I, there, I think I briefly was talking before, but there is uh, the YouTube update that censors words on your screen now. If you got a swear word on a, going across screen, like, I can't even say what, but it's got swear words, there's going to be a black line across that. And, and if your uh, video description's got swear words and there's something that's rude or not appropriate for other people, It'll be, it'll be reworded or the video will be taken down. And the next step after that is that if you're swearing in the videos, there's going to be some bleeping or they're going to be like a soft sh you know, to it. You won't be swearing and stuff like that. And pretty soon, probably, if 
I mean, if they do it automatically, if I get a chance to do that myself, if I go to the mall or the grocery store and then, you know, talk, uh, talk about my daily grocery shopping and, you know, take a look at this, I'm going to be buying this, I'm going to be buying that, and if I can blur each uh, brand name and product, then it could be a video. I could, you know, keep it as a video, but, um, I don't know. I, I, I can't do it because I'm going to be copyrighted for brand names. The brand names pop up my videos and uh, I don't have the okay from that company. I'm just going to be copyrighted. So if I get a chance to blur things out, I don't have the, the software for that. But if YouTube actually gives you the software tool for that. What are you doing, cat? Silly cat. Then I'm going to give them a chance to blur labels and names and brands and stuff with that. And it should be good, you know. It should be good. Look, I want to, you know, take you guys grocery shopping. You know, show you what I buy, you know, month after month. Sometimes things change. It depends on my budget. depends on, you know, how long I'm going to be around here or, you know, where I'm going to be or what the weather's like. Even, you know, yeah, I even buy things different from the weather, you know. If I'm going to be on biking stuff, I want to get some citruses and fruits and veggies. More of that because I'm going to be on bike and burning the energy anyway. I need that for muscle, bones, and and uh, mind and body and soul kind of thing. Anyway, there's still some cars going by. I'm surprised, you know, that one car's not going by just yet. Or, I mean, buses going by yet. you got to knock over my tripod, silly cat. Now she's laying between the tripod legs. And what I have to keep this on its feet, because this is such a uh, you know, slippery floor, I had to put some spare socks down and have the legs sit on these socks so the legs don't you know, go out, you know, like that. Or, or that's going to go backwards. Or this legs going to go forward. There's a time that, you know, I had the camera almost hit me in the face because it just was it's like, almost like, it's like, caught it's like whoa catch on it it's like strangle it like like strangling somebody's neck <clears throat> and sometimes you know I thought going to turn on my music and get in front of the camera to be ready and sometimes I end up you know bumping it with my my foot and then it just zoo, goes by it's like oh come on I don't have time for this like I want to get these videos out for my viewers there's some clouds here and there that I see right now and um I don't know, it's kind of like stretched out, like it's like a haze. I guess you would say if you were to stretch out cotton, like you would pull the car apart and then you'd just be like really hazy in, like in your face and stuff. Um, anyway, today was not a bad day at all. It's, you know, it's still like midday to me. Uh, sometimes my day doesn't start until like 8 or 9 anyway, and sometimes as early as 6, and that's very rarely at 6 o'clock. Um, more number on eight or nine, and then it's also another rare to be you know going out out of here around twelve or one o'clock if if I'm not sore or sick or some of that. Anyway, I don't really have anything more to say. I might just wrap this up because I'm just rambling on and on. If you guys like this video, please do hit the like button. Please subscribe to me. I share this video on my channel. It might benefit you. It might benefit me. Please do tell your friends and family about me. Thank you for viewing this video. When you guys watch it, hope you all have a nice day. It's morning and night. Remember, it's better to be average than original.